it's so funny like cutting them all up and getting them prepped is the definitely the fastest part and then the putzing around with <laughs> with it uh ends up always being what takes forever for me but i just really want to decorate so let's just decorate let's see i have these um hole hole punch reinforcers these are ones that i hand did with my ink so they were just white ones and then i inked them and then these are ones that i bought at the office supply store that have like they're actually metallic they say like gold bronze copper silver whatever so those are fun i got a few more left on this sheet so i'm just gonna use use them up and i have been hoarding this paper for a long time because i think it's so pretty Actually, you know what it reminds me of? What was that show? Oh, whew, Helen Hunt was in it. And um, I don't remember the guy's name. But anyway, they had like a little apartment in the city. And it was just a little sitcom show. Don't remember the name of it. But anyway, there was a little couch that she had in the corner. And it, I loved the upholstery. It was like a cream background with like these roses. And it really reminds me of that. <laughs> That's a weird thing to remember. The upholstery. That's just how my mind works. I can remember the upholstery, but not the name of the show. <laughs> so when there's like a floral background, I'm going to flip these over. because I know these are polka dots on one side, but I'm going to decorate the flower side. Oh, this is going to be a tag too. So... Oh, let's do both. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I forgot. We still had some of this left. So these bottom ones are going to be two tiny tags. And then the top ones. Actually, I could do a small hole punch for these. And then the, top, the other ones are going to be big, bigger tags. I'm going to do this side. One of my favorite things to do for these double-sided ones is to take the opposite side. And actually, this looks cute and create little little corners at the bottom so just glue those on <laughs> my glue will come out Doo -doo -doo. Maybe one of these deals. Now, because these are so flowery, I figure I can use some of my utility things. And some of these advertisements are a little bit more utility-esque. This one's actually really wide. What was I gonna, I was gonna put something with that. Oh yeah, this little flower over the top. And I have these, these things, these fleur de lis, and they're, I have black, silver, and blue. Let's try this on one. Squeaky, squeaky paper. Try it at the top.
And I got a fish. <laughs> I don't know why I like the fl the fish on flowers, but I just do. <laughs> so we got Shasta. Oh, remember Shasta? I hardly do. <laughs> and I have these uh, typewriter letters that are kind of brownish. I have, I somebody had like a million sets and I ended up purchasing them at a sale. It was an estate sale, actually. And they had a lot of them. A whole lot, a lot, of, and they won't come out. Smoke, come out. Okay. I've got the little deal. Just gonna ink around that. Tore the washi sticker. are cute and then I did this one before um whoops love this one I like opening a letter and thinking myself loved Virginia Woolf and then it's got a little desk with a letter well, that's fun all right let's try some of these oh, some of these aren't cut out all the way that one's nice Hmm. This one kind of needs to be this way. Uncle Sam. Oh, the green's cute. Cherry blossom with the kitties. Oh, nice. I don't know if I need... Oh, here's a, like, pointy finger one. Well, I'm going to do this one because I like it. Trim the bottom off there. We have this little border. Ink it up. I like the green. A little gesso. Give that a more of a matte finish. Oh, too much. Too much. All right, we're going to put it on this one. Well, the calendar is really pretty. So go good on one of these.
Now oh, these are quite cute. I was thinking I was going to be doing a collage, but that's not really what this is turning out to be. Uh, I do have this little sticker set. Hope this is big enough. It's a cute little dress. And then a quote. It says, To dance is to dream. That one's almost dry. I don't think it needs more of anything. That covers up too much. There's a little sticker. Okay, I have two of those stickers. I can do one on each end. That might work. One on each corner. Yeah, that's better. Where's my little garbage can? That is better. Still not quite dry. That's okay. And then, of course, we have that one, which is okay. It's all right. These are still drying. Kind of picking things that go with the Burnett's Pink Lemonade. That's a new, a new one. It looks kind of old, but. It's a very little, little tag. Thirsty? Just whistle the handy bottle. What does that mean? I think it's some kind of soda. Soda pop. Oh, this is for Singer Sewing Machine. Snag proof. Rubber boots, snag proof. <laughs> oh, that's pretty. Well, there it goes. I think it might be too big for these tags. Just too big. One would look really good with. Oh, that's nice. I could do this over the top. That would be good. Get my glue out here. These are more like scrapbooking supplies than junk journal supplies today, but. Oh, wow, that looks good. Definitely gonna need gesso on that one. I could do it on that sticker too. 
See how that turns out. Okay. Kind of takes up the whole thing. I think I'm just going to put it off to the side a little bit and then I'll give us some room to add some other things. I got some new map atlases. I don't know. Oh, wow. There's like a fox. Red fox. Cool. <laughs> Ducks. I didn't notice there were like little pets and stuff in there. Oh, the, that symbol is kind of neat. That would be kind of fun. I don't think I would go with it. Maybe it would if I... This is all the same color. Let me just tear out. Oh, badger. That's the state animal in Wisconsin. Crappie. Um, oh, look, they have the state and the county. That's pretty handy, actually. Another fox. I'm getting really distracted. Now I never noticed that there were these animals in here. Wait a minute. There's a Bobcat. Bunny. Can you see the bunny? Oh, probably not. Here's the bunny. There it is. Oh, the bunny. Okay, there's another bunny. Here, let's out. Oh, <laughs> two pages. Whoop. Make it a little crinkly. Okay, where were we? We're over here. Yeah, that looks good. I can get this glue to cooperate. these little washi stickers to maybe come down the side like that. How cute. Well, like that. What else do they have? Where's that other one? Here it is. Whew. Extra large star soap. Yeah. And we're doing it. I 
just have so many of these things that I should be using. Yeah, those are fun. Oh, these are small enough. Oh, that's a pretty one. There, can maybe trim that a bit. off kilter it's okay I can do the fish wouldn't that be crazy <laughs> or a seashell <laughs> oh the seashell's too big I wanted to do a T one everything's too big the more in here a little too big covers up her lovely hat we don't want that oh forget it i'm gonna get out my flowers tiny flowers those look really good on there Hmm. Is it too big? Nah, it's not too big. That just looks good. There we go. And you can still see her hat. Oh, that's neat. I got a scribble flower. <laughs> like two coats of the same size. Oh wow, this is really cute. This little it's like a little bird on a on a vine situation. These are antiquarian stickers. Do two of those maybe? No. I do like the flower on there though. Reinforcement. There we 
go. And yes, I, I got a new glue stick and I painted it because I'm not that crazy about orange and I got rid of a bunch of the orange. Yep, that was what I did. I used nail polish. Uh-huh. Got this little plate of goodies now. Check my tinies. Tiny bits and things. This one's really tiny stuff. Oh, these are like little bitty flowers. Do like two of them. Two of them. Oh, that doesn't look good. Nope. No, I don't like any of that. Like these little buttons. This little tiny thing. Get it out of there. flower. <laughs> okay, so now I have that and then I could add like a word or something across it. And word art. After much, much futzing, futzing. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do a T1 because I've got, I've got sugar and creamer. This one had a teapot on it and it's got a little tea box. These are just cute little Cute little stickers. Well, that doesn't come out. Some sugar, sugar, tea, cream. What else? It's got a little like diffuser thing. Do we need that? Sure, why not? It's like random, random stickers on there. <laughs> random. Little heart at the top. What the heck? Why not, right? 
And then... Little gesso. Those are just kind of cute, and maybe I like this little lace, lace stickery thing. That might be too big. Too big. Oh, that's neat. It's actually a pretty pretty good size for that. Whoop. Pretty good. Those are cute little, little stickers. Trim these edges. That's maybe a thing. Now I'm getting to the point where I can't decide stuff. <laughs> but I have a lot of cute stuff so far. Hmm. I think I'm gonna put this one down and glue that like so. I'll glue over the top too. Because I know this is really fragile. It came from a very old fragile book. So just give it a little extra reinforcement. And then I can figure out what I'm gonna put on the top. from a gardening book when your finger fingers nettles find be sure a dock is close behind oh you know what i'll just trim off a quote maybe to the side Do that. Or maybe at the top.
kind of want to frame that on something. Something, something. Just a little something. I like it. <laughs> I finally, I couldn't decide at first, but then I decided I did. I did like it. <laughs> Just too small. Too small. Flower to the side, maybe. I think this will be my last one. some extra glue and some gesso oh well oh that, I just wanted to go a little <laughs> on a lot there we go okay oh dear I have to put some of that back in the jar Deglossified. There we go. And those will dry. All right. Well, I that was a lot. Still, pretty short amount of time because I did all of these. So yeah. And then all the backs are already have, you know, some design on it. So it's pretty much ready to go. All right. Well, these were fun. I hope you enjoyed this. Just a little fun projects to get out your stuff that you have already. That you, uh, your little collections, maybe alphabet letters and flowers and just whatever ephemera, ephemera you have laying around, make little combinations. and So you can put whatever strikes your fancy on your tags. So, because you got a lot of them, right? <laughs> All right. Well, as always, thanks for coming along. Uh, the link to my Etsy shop is in the description. I have lots of junk journal items for sale there, especially a few digitals. Thanks for coming along. I'll talk to you later.